Welcome to the Minds Federation Return to Fitness Cool Down video. So you should have just done a core workout and a plyometric workout. So now we're going to do a quick cool down to make sure you do not ache the next day or try to limit the amount of aching you got the next day as well. So what I need to do, okay, is you just done your finished off your my steps, and now you just done your finished off your my steps in the plyometrics. What I want you to do is do a double step for me to cool down. So this should be a lot less intense than we do in the biometrics. Okay, so just do a double step. One, two, three, up, one, two, three, up. Much less in intensity than we had in the biometric session. Okay, as you're down, you go up and down with your hands. Make sure your arms are pretty relaxed as well. Make sure the lactic acid comes out of all, all the working muscles we are working as well. Okay, then I want you to be walk. Now I'll do the single steps. So again, using your arms. Okay, making sure making sure your arms are working a little bit to make sure you can get the lactic acid out as well. Okay, then I want you to be doing that pigeon walk we had done in the warm up. Again, making sure we can the joints and the ankle doesn't get them become too tired. Okay, then I want you to be walk normally. As you know, walking your tiptoes side, walking your tiptoes. Okay, and then walk normally. Okay, then I want you to go up and down the ankle. Okay, again, making sure we've just been working a lot on our legs for the biometric session. We don't want our Ankle and knee joints to seize up, and again with the arms as well. Okay, then rotate your ankle, rotate the other ankle. Okay, I want you to do the quad stretch, hold it. Okay, switch legs. Go back to your first leg, do it again. Okay, go back to your second leg. Again, again, we did the hamstring stretch. So you're putting your one foot forward, leaning back slightly, and then putting your hand on the leg which isn't sticking out. So get your leg there. You should be feeling it all the way down there, all the way down there as well. Okay, switch legs. Switch legs again. Change legs. The next one, you work on the glutes as well. If you can, you can do this laying down. Okay, we are going to repeat it laying down anyway. If you can do it standing up, it's great. This is a full squat, so you're going to do a full like that. Okay, it doesn't, no, it doesn't look like a full really. And then going down, if you can. Hold it. Come back up. Change legs. Be nice and balanced, there's the ball. Go down, go up, 
thời trang Come back up, change legs, go back to the original one. Hold. Come back up, go back to your second leg, your second four. Get down. Go back up. Okay, now we'll do some arm stretches again. So again, arm goes across the body. Not push on the elbow, go across. Two chance. Go back to your first arm. Switch over. And so then next one we're going to go behind, because behind you can push against it, hold. Again, switch over. Switch on the side. So lots of these are going to go on the floor. So what you need to do, okay, is go and go around your hands. Okay, you're going to bring your knee straight up to your chest and hold it in. Okay, you take that leg back down, you lift the other leg. Your leg's going straight up, hold to your chest, hold. Okay, and change legs. Go back to your second leg. And stop there. Next one, we're going to place the. Okay, this next one, you're going to bring your knee across again. So you're still going straight up, you're going to push your body, you hold it, and this is stretching out. The hamstring and your glute as well. Okay, and then both the same legs, move the other leg up and then across. And then shift the elbow on the other side as well. Go up to your first leg, bring it up and across. Then go back to your second leg. And relax. Next one, split up the four. Okay. Four squat. Again, it's now on your back. So you bring your leg up. Okay, so you, that leg goes across behind the knee. Bring that knee up. There should be a gap there. Then you hold it. And so the leg is coming back down. That leg we haven't been stretching yet goes across. Bring that just by the knee, then put the knee to your chest. Again, we should be feeling it all up there as well. Again, okay, then go back to your first leg. Okay, and then switch over. And switch there. Then come back up, sit up. Sit up, you're going to bring your knee across. Again, again, we're working most of our glutes. Should be up here, because that's what a lot of the muscle we've been using for the plyometrics as well. Change legs, so legs coming across your body and bringing it into your chest. You should be feeling it all across up there. 
Okay, go back to your first leg. Go back to your second leg. Last movement I want to do, okay, is to reach up, try and go down to your toes. Your legs should be straight, so this would be where you find out and your legs aren't straight. Reach up, try to touch your toes. Come back up one more time, and then back down and as well. And this should be stretching out all your hamstrings and hands for you. Okay, that is it for the cool down. I hope you are feeling alright and hope you don't ache too much the next in the upcoming days and see you for the next session.